Hey folks, welcome back to another video. Okay, so Facebook hasn't added your side quest games on App Lab that you really want to play. And you can't sideload them because you don't have a PC. Well, have no fear, Whackman is here. Today, I'm giving you another gem, as we are going to sideload games directly from your quest without needing a PC or even App Lab. So if you enjoyed the video, then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel, as it lets me know to make more of this type of content. Talking about special. Remember I have a giveaway for the Walking Dead Saints and Sinners on Steam and for a secret Oculus Quest 2 game. So if you want to enter, it's really simple. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, put notifications on and pick the game you want to enter for by commenting either hashtag Walking Dead or hashtag Secret Quest 2 game down below. This might be your last chance to enter so make sure you're in it to win it. Well, let's get straight into the video. Okay, so to start, I want to talk about the iPhone users. The method I'm about to show you will install games directly on your Quest, so it won't matter what phone you have. However, there is one small step that you do need to do before you can do that, and unfortunately you will need to use either an Android phone or a computer. But you will only need it once and then never again, so if you can borrow a phone for a few minutes, then great, you can do it. Otherwise, I'm sorry. Alright, now let's go through how to actually do it. Step 1. Go on the Play Store on your phone and download and install an app called CX File Explorer. It's free and doesn't have ads, which is why I chose this one, but others work as well. Step 2. Download an app called APK Extractor, which will simply allow you to extract the APK, as the name suggests. Step 3. Open up APK Extractor and extract the APK from CX File Explorer. Make sure you remember where it gets extracted to, as you will need it later. Step 4. Download and install the Bugjager app if you haven't already got that. As I have used this app in a lot of my videos, you might already do. Also. Please note that you need to have developer mode activated on your account. I have linked a video above and in the description that might help you through the process. Ok, now connect your phone to your Oculus Quest using a cable. I have linked an all-in-one adapter in the description if you don't have a phone with a USB-C port, as you can use the charging cable that came with the headset for this. Once you have connected the phone to the Quest, make sure you press allow in the headset. If nothing pops up, restart both your phone and your headset, then try again. Another pop-up may appear asking you to allow debugging if you haven't accepted that previously. Now make sure you're on the Packages tab in the Bugjager app. A lot of people are on the wrong tab and then blame me that it doesn't work. Then press the plus icon at the top and then press OK to install the APK. Find the APK that you extracted for CX File Explorer and install it on your Quest. When it's done installing, that's it. You won't need your phone ever again. You can throw it out of the window. Now you can just disconnect the cable. Now what we need to do is go into your Quest headset and then go into the browser tab. There are many ways to do this, but we will go to sidequest.com. Find a game that you want and we basically need to find the APK file to download. Now in this example, I'm going to use AMXR as it's right there in front of me and looks interesting. Now when I go into the listing, if it says install to headset, we can't use that without sidequest itself. However, that's not gonna stop the Whackman army. So scroll down and see if you can find a link to download the game. If it's on itch.io, then that makes things a lot easier for us. And this one is. So click on the link, then click on download now. Then an option will come up asking to donate. If you can, it helps the developers. But if you have no money, click on no thanks, just take me to the downloads. Then just click download. Once the download is complete, go into applications, unknown sources, and click on CX File Explorer. Then go into the download section and click on the game that you just downloaded and press install. Once it has installed, you can either just press open or you can go back into unknown sources and your game will be there. And that's it. For any new games, you just need to find it using the browser tab, download and then install it using the CX Explorer app. It's now so much easier. Come on, you know this video deserves a like and a subscribe. Well, that's all folks. I hope this video has helped and made things a lot easier for you. And if you enjoyed the video, then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Also remember to enter my Walking Dead and Secret Quest 2 game giveaway as the time is almost up. Well, thanks for watching. Have a great day, stay safe and see you next time.